So I walk for me, uh, we're an organization led by incarcerated peoples and supported by accomplices on the outside, that's us. We don't really like to use the word ally, accomplice. Uh, and the goal of IWALK is to abolish prison slavery, among other things. Um, last year, there was a nationwide prison strike, which began on August 21st, the day which commemorates the death of George Jackson, and also commemorates the beginning of the Haitian Revolution. And the strike ended on September 9th, which is in accordance with the Attica Uprising. Um, prisoners released a set of ten demands, some of which included ending gang enhancement laws and reinstating voting rights for people who are currently serving. Uh, sentences, ex-felons, and so on. Uh, locally, IWAP, we've been involved with you know reaching out to prisoners at the ACI. Uh, you know during the the strike last year, we held the noise demo to try and make contact with people on the ACI. Since then, you know we've made contact with some people. We've been trying to amplify their voices, their grievances, and you know provide resources any way we can. Whether that looks like mail, just somebody to talk to, stamps, letters, that sort of thing. Um, and as for IWALK in terms of like our values as an organization, we do prioritize direct action, self-defense, building community, counter institutions, and we're oriented and you know, we want to build and collaborate with other organizations that share abolitionist politics. So locally that, you know, that plays out with groups like Black and Pink, we've been collaborating with Black and Pink, which, which is a prison abolitionist group that works specifically with LGBTQ plus prisoners. Um, they've been pushing forth a, a piece of legislation that uh, offers juvenile lifers a chance at parole. Um, and we've also been in, in a more limited capacity working with AMOR, which is a, organization of different, a, a coalition of different organizations that's resisting deportations and you know, the general Gestapo-like behavior of, the, of ICE. And you know, we generally involve ourselves in anti-police, anti-prison, anti-ICE struggles, and that's sort of why we wanted to organize this event today. Um, so I'm going to throw it over to PSU and then I'll introduce Alex afterwards.